Hi, uh, I've been following Remy Sharp's posts that he's been doing recently about his workflow um, and how he stays within the Chrome DevTools to uh, edit his files on disk, which is really cool. We've been using uh, CSS preprocessors as well. Uh, but I've just uh, got two questions, um, one of which that I can't seem to uh, get working is that um, that's cool there that it's seen the SAS file, that's awesome. And I can command click on this, which will then take me to the sources pane and I can edit the file there, which is cool. But I was wondering if it's possible that I can just click in here and edit something. So it seems when you do that, um, it, everything changes back to the CSS, uh, sorry, the CSS file um, rather than the SAS file. And then if you try and do that, um, you're still within the CSS file. So it'd be nice if we could just edit the, uh, the SAS file directly from disk here. That would be cool. And then the other thing that I'm finding uh, a bit frustrating is if I'm working on multiple projects, uh, is I seem to I want to be able to set up that there for my project, which was working a second ago. And now I've just set up another project here, um, and I set my WordPress one up here, and got rid of this here. Um, and now I can't seem to add this back again. Uh, oh, there we go. Okay, so now I've got the HTML5 boilerplate one there and the WordPress one there. But if I close those down and reopen them, um, have a little shortcut there, short and uh, question mark. And um, workspace. Oh, okay. So maybe they always stay there. How does it know which one that I'm working on? No, it doesn't seem to be working now. So yeah, I'm just not too sure about those bits. Um, editing directly in the inspector and this whole thing with setting up your uh, your folders path. So if anyone can help with that, that'd be great. Cheers. Bye.